Hello students, PhD study 1 from chapter number 3, linear equation in two variable. So question is a test consists of true or false questions. Okay. One mark is awarded for every correct answer plus one. And one four one by four mark is deducted for every wrong answer. One by four minus. I student new answers to some of the questions and rest of the questions he attempted by guessing. So there are two uh, types of questions answered by the student right one is the answers which he knew already and one which he attempted by guessing so that means these are the our two variables x and y we will suppose accordingly he answered 120 question okay so what we will do let x be the number of questions for which he knew answer for which he knew answer okay and why be the question for which he guess okay so total uh, total questions are 120 that means can we write x plus y is equal to 120 yes so this will be our first equation now um, uh, uh, means condition related to marks is also given he got 90 marks okay so if what we can write here for every correct answer that means suppose x into 1 he getting 1 mark okay so x and for wrong answer 1 by 4 so 1 by 4 of y assuming that all the answers which he knew is correct okay so x into 1 because we supposed here no? x be the number of question for which he knew the answer and supposing or assuming that whatever uh, questions he guessed that is wrong answers given by him so for every y question 1 by 4 marks so 1 by 4 into y equals to 90 so if we simplify this particular equation second equation because fraction is there in coefficient cross multiply we can do right 4 will come so finally 4x minus y is equal to 360 so this is our second equation so first equation and second equation we got now we'll go to the questions here or first week what we can do we can find x and y anyway questions will be based on these values only right so we'll find x and y here this is the table given okay marks given for correct answer marks deducted for wrong answer 0.25 means 1 by 4 only so we, we are uh, our equations are x plus y is equal to 120 4x minus y is 360 so by elimination method we will solve we will add both the equation so we'll get 5x this will go and here 480 so x will be 480 by 5 so if we cancel this we will get 5 nines are 45 and then so that means correct answer or the questions for that answer he knew are total in 20 sorry 96 isn't it now put x value 96 in x plus y equal to 120 so we will get y value here okay so y value uh, x equal to 96 plus y equal to 120 y value will be 120 minus 96 that means 24 so these are the wrong answers given by him now we'll go to the questions question is if answer to all questions he attempted by guessing were wrong and the same thing we have assumed whatever answer he assumed it is wrong okay that that's why we multiplied wrong marks 1 by 4 marks to y to get the equation how many questions did he answer correctly means we should find x here already we found that x is 96 question 2 is how many questions did he guess that means y value right and already we know y value we got as 24 so 24 questions he guessed 
uh, he guessed only okay then moving to the next question next question is if answer to all questions he attempted by guessing were wrong and answered 80 correctly see total questions he answered 120 right so 80 correctly means x equal to 80 val value and uh, remaining will be y that is 180 minus sorry 120 minus 80 that is 40 okay so we know our x and y value here 80 and 40 how many marks he got so that second equation we have to consider here for marks x minus 1 by 4 y isn't it <coughs> so x is 80 1 by 4 y is 40 so if we cancel this we get 80 minus 10 that is 70 so he will get 70 marks next question if answers to all questions he attempted by guessing were wrong that means y only which we have assumed already how many questions answered correctly means x value we should find and total score given 95 okay same second equation will be using so suppose x answered correctly and total is 120 isn't it x plus y is 120 so what will be y value 120 minus x isn't it because y value is not given so what we will do x minus 1 by 4 y value 120 minus x and total score is 95 now open the bracket we'll get 30 here plus x by 4 so x plus x by 4 95 plus 30 that gives 125 and here cross multiply 4x plus x by 4 so 5x is equal to 125 into 4 that will be 125 into 4 by 5 if you do 25 into 4 that is 100 so 100 questions he answered correctly 